Democrats make welcome baskets for refugees, but add an extra item that will make you sick. Hello everyone, Jen here, Golden State Times, and today we have a news story. This one comes courtesy of the Conservative Tribune, and it says, Nebraska Democrat Party Chairwoman Jane Kleeb posted a video on Facebook last week showing herself and her staff preparing a bunch of welcome baskets for incoming refugees and immigrants. While most of the basket contents were acceptable, there was one item that was not okay. Kleeb said, quote, We've made sure that we had individuals write little notes to the families. And then inside each basket, there's also a letter from the Nebraska Democratic Party welcoming the family to Nebraska. She went on to say, quote, It's signed by me as chair of the party. And then we included a sticker in there so they can put it on their car. Okay, fine. I'm not sure how many refugees are driving their own cars, but whatever. So, so far so good until, quote, it also included a voter registration, she added. So it looks like Democrats aren't even trying to hide their malicious and underhanded behavior anymore. They're doing it publicly without any scruples whatsoever. So when asked if she had made it clear to the refugees and immigrants that completing and submitting those forms would be illegal, Cleve tried another flimsy excuse. She said, quote, Can I just be very clear that on the voter registration form, it says that you have to be a U.S. citizen, so I don't think that I said that in the letter, but on the voter registration form, it talks about that. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what to say. But in reality, folks, this is nothing new. You know, this is how the left works. They have done it to all minority groups since the, since the Europeans have been coming off the boats in Ellis Island and also on Star Island. And in reality, they continue it till this day, right? The new ones are now these refugees that are coming over from terrorist countries. They do it now on video in broad daylight because they know that Republicans are not going to do anything about it. And in reality, most likely they never will, right? The Democrats right now are running rampant and doing absolutely anything and everything they want. They get away with everything. They can go out and disrupt and do anything they want. As of right now, they can go to peaceful Trump rallies and beat up people that police want to arrest them. They can try to disrupt people's offices, block them from getting in, trying to get them kicked out by, by their landlords. Nothing is done. They can go and disrupt town halls. They can go and disrupt uh, Senate hearings. Nothing is done. Hillary Clinton got a whole bunch of people killed in Benghazi. She's still out free. Obama can wiretap or Obama can sell um, arms and, and, and guns and ammo to terrorists. He, right now he's like in Bermuda or Tahiti or wherever in the world he's at. He's at surfing and, and having a good old time on the American taxpayer dollar. So this is nothing new. And they're doing it in broad daylight and they're going to continue doing it because they can get away with it. It's ridiculous. And they shouldn't be getting away with it. But the rhinos are in bed with them. And as long as we have these rhinos and we have no law and order, this is going to continue happening. Like I said, it's been happening since immigrants were coming from uh, in from Ellis Island, Star Island. And it's going to continue happening, folks. But make sure you share this report so we can get the word out that this is happening right now. Okay. Let's get these people fired. Maybe that can help out a little bit because as of right now, the administration is not doing anything. Nobody is doing anything to these people. But at least we can get the word out and get them fired. That's one part of the battle. So let's do that. Make sure you share this report. Make sure you smash that like button. Let us know what you guys think in the comment section below. And like always, like this video, share this video. 
Subscribe if you are if you like what we do. Make sure you click that notification bell too. And I hope to see you guys here next time. Check the links in the description. See you guys on chat or at our next news video. Thank you very much, everyone. My name is Gent. I am your host. And I'll see you soon. Peace. So yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. Let us know what you guys think in the comments section below. Give this video a thumbs up and share it on social media. Check out our previous videos that should be coming up on the right side of your screen. Click on them. They're interactive. They'll take you to the video you might want to watch. Give it a thumbs up and share it while you're over there. Check out the links in the description below. If you are new to our community, we encourage you to subscribe by clicking the red button below the video or the golden globe that will be coming up on your screen. We welcome you and hope to see you guys here next time. But until then, peace.